who's the hot stuff right now. But you gotta remember, there are 75 characters in this game. There's no way, like we know everything. Yeah. So seeing stuff like this or Robins in Winners Finals at a, you yeah. know, a, a hard event for a weekly local, you know. Yeah, and no better Robin to do it than Jewel. He's been playing him since Smash 4, you know. So here we go. Yeah, this is gonna be a Fire Emblem Awakening match off, daughter versus mother. What? That was almost scary. Yeah, that, 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 he that, did. I felt that that could have spiked. Definitely. Yeah, he he only got the second one of a B. Uh, he if he got the first one, then he probably would have got spiked. But it was too low percent, and he still had his jump, so it wasn't that scary. So Ralphie, when you fight off against Robin, like the first thing you think about is the projectiles, right? Yeah, yeah. All right. So so like one thing Jules really good at is he mixes up like B reverses and like you saw that wave land on the platform. He's just really tricky with his movement. And then he makes you fear like arc fire, neutral B, and, and the command grab. And then he he spaces out his aerials and like delays his timings really well. That was a fantastic tech. Yeah. Yeah, and this is this is a spot that Eric has been asking me a lot. How do I get off the ledge versus arc fire? And he rolled twice. So all right, I want to honestly, it's a, it's a timing thing. Like right there, yeah. he managed to go for the dolphin slash in between the arc fires yeah. so he could time it. Managed to take away stage control and got the kill mystery with the stock lead. Yep, yep. And there we go with the B reverse into the immediate jump back here. All right, that is death. Yeah, he should be. Yeah, yeah that, he, he got caught without his jump. And that nair sends you at like kind of like a semi spike angle. Mm -hmm. So like, he saw that Mr. Yu was vulnerable, and instead of grabbing the ledge, he went for the aggressive play and got the stock off of it. Okay, again, Jewel trying to chill a little bit backwards, and you, yeah. you talked about how his movement's really tricky. And I've noticed this just him evolving in Ultimate alone. Yeah. How much more his, how much more slick his movement has gotten in like the past yeah. month. And you see him throwing out like those uncharged neutral bees. Mm -hmm. uh, they true combo into a dash tech, I think. And uh, he wants to waste them so he, he could have the book in hand because he likes playing around with the items. Now, at this point, he lost his wind book. So, like, that could have been an opportunity for Mystery to try to push him off stage and apply yeah, tons of pressure. Sure. But it's so rare to see Robin without that spell that yeah. you just sometimes you don't even realize. All right, here we go. Tries to go for the back air off stage a little bit too high. Yeah, and a character like Lucina could definitely go off in edge guard Robin because that only has a hitbox like uh, under Robin. So like if Eric goes from the top or like towards the sides, he could get a stage spike or a spike. So, Which would be a huge yeah. game changer. Yeah, for sure. Get him at 128. Is that, he uses double jump. This could be a potential edge guard. Finally there connects the back air he's been looking for the entire game. Yeah. Brings to a final stock situation. Great parry, and he yeah. got a lot of mileage off of yeah. that. That that's something Eric needs to fix in his gameplay. Like he was only at seventy percent there, but he always goes for the aggressive downer whenever he's too like scared. And Jewel off that parry into up tilt, runs back, whip punishes that that downer with a forward smash, and it's even now. And it's funny that you mentioned that Mystery is such an aggressive like play style because yeah. like that's he's always been known like that yeah. ever since Smash Four ever since Brawl for heaven's sake he's always been the guy once again your face and just mash buttons yeah but I I mean like in disadvantage you had to take it slow sometimes because you don't want to just like swing on landing and have have your moves get whiff punished because you'll lose the stock as early as he did at like seventy percent. Mm. Okay. Well, we got a response off yeah. the parry. One ten percent mystery. Not doesn't want to go off stage too early to risk it accidentally like throwing away his stock. Yeah. Wants to stay on the stage instead. Try to bait out, make 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 Jewel feel fearful. Gets the trump back airs himself to victory. Moving on to game two. Yeah, mystery just looks full in control there. I won. So, you know, Mystery, you know, being the Lucina main he is, doesn't really play any other character. I know in the beginning of Ultimate, he was uh, trying out Wolf. Wolf. Yeah. Then he went on to Marth. And he tried Marth for, like, yeah. the longest time, but it just yeah. it didn't work out. He, he held on to Marth longer than MKLeo. Like, yeah. even, though, even when no, MKLeo... Leo's going back to Marth now. Oh, because of... Is, <laughs> don't tell me it's because of that side view. I have no clue. Do you, you know what side view I'm talking about? No. There's a side view where he got against uh, Zero online. Oh, really? like he, he killed him at like 60% because he comboed it into Tipper somehow. Yeah, I, I know he, I know he's been like grinding his Marth. He said he he uh, wants to use Marth. Yeah, yeah. I don't know, like 100% over Lucina, but he he does want to use Marth a little bit. Well, Marth has that explosive factor that Lucina. Yeah. I mean, Lucina still has kind of that, yeah. but Lucina's not killing you off the Tipper wow. forward smash on the edge at like 40. And, and that was a crazy interaction from Jewel. He parried, then read a spot dodge with a falling up air, got an air, tech chased him, 
with the command grab, and now Mr. E is dead. <laughs> He's moving! Yep. Jewel just played that stock perfectly. Like, he, he had a read on every single option that Mr. E did there. And we've been seeing that a lot today. Just in all the sets, like, the, the first stocks have just been, always been, like, zero deaths almost. Yep. And now Mr. E's responding in kind. All right, shot down back air. Oh, he tried to go for the spike a little bit too soon. Yeah. 29 off of Arc Thunder? All right. And the platform kind of messing up Jewel's pressure there. He definitely wanted to put it in the corner like he is doing now. All right. Jewel baited out the roll onto the stage. Yeah. That was a slick little uh, setup. Didn't really get too much mileage yeah. off of it. So, so you notice that Jewel did the offstage arc fire there, yeah. and that was only because he only had one arc fire left. So he knew he either went offstage and did that, or set it up once, and then he wouldn't have any more ledge pressure. So he went out for a read. Now he's playing some basketball with that sword. Whenever Robin loses his sword, he's able to like dribble it a lot, and he can throw it towards his opponent. Still has a lot of knockback, and it's a fearful item for the opponents to have to deal with. Yeah. When that like medium charge neutral B is like. Pretty good at killing like towards the edge at these higher percents. Yeah. What a setup. Yeah. He actually dropped the book to like try to apply shield yeah. pressure in the middle of that. Yeah, he was late with the forward smash punish, but he knew the book was gonna cover him. Okay, just safe kill. Like fade away yeah. neutral air. Probably yeah. one of the safest kits in her book. Yeah. And I noticed that Mr. He's not really going for much grabs in the corner, even though Jewel's literally giving him shields. He, he's scared of uh, Jewel spot dodging and reversing on him. Up oh, does the follow up back air. Yeah, at that point, Mr. E's like going for like some, uh, trying to catch that two frame a little too soon with that forward smash. Yeah. Going off stage, great tech from Jewel. It's not going to work on him at that low percent. Yeah. And, and if Mr. E thinks he'll tech the back air, he goes for the up B because he grabs the ledge simultaneously. Mm -hmm. And if he techs, then he's still in a good position. At uh, worst, uh, worst, yeah. worst case scenario, he tacks on damage. Yeah. Because oh, if he, he techs the back air, then yeah. He got it. Okay, so he didn't get too much off of that, but I was hoping for something after the nose for Ratsu. Doesn't yeah. need it. Up air. He's loving. 122% on Mr. E. And he's swinging. Tries to catch him again with the little sneaker rooney. Yeah, because he wants to go to uh, for the command grab to heal when he has the lead. It just makes it so much more frustrating to fight him with a lead. Goes for the parry into a jab Turn for the kill. Jab. Wow. You know she learned that from Krom, you know? <laughs> Killing yeah. off a jab. Yeah. You've seen it. Instead of jab for, uh, forward air or jab back air, it's just straight up jab one, two, three. Yo, wait, was that male Robin? Yeah, yeah. He, he, oh, so it's not the mother. I said that was mother versus daughter in the beginning. But that was game one. He went. He was definitely female. He was definitely female game one, right? He always does that. Female than male for game two? Yeah, he alternates. Okay. He might be female now. Yeah. I feel it. I that, get it. That one was definitely the male Robin, though. That yeah, too. Because the way he said Lucina, it was so deep. Oh, he's going to say with the male Robin because he won that game, probably. That's how it works, right? It's like, if, yeah. if, if, I definitely do that. If, if female, if one costume doesn't work, then the other costume will. Uh-huh. For sure. Okay, final destination wants to get rid of all the platforms, so it does uh, it defense. Okay. Okay, Jewel. Thunder. thunder. Just spam. Thunder. 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 All right. Throw it out there. And Mystery e, uh, came in with like a rising nair there, and Jewel had no guaranteed punish, but he knew Mystery e was going to go for a spot dodge after, so he just drop shield jab, multi jab, done. Smart option to go for. All right. Juggle situation for Jewel here. His, yeah, the sword is going away now. And that actually, you so notice that sword dropping right in the perfect spot for Mystery. He had to go for a spot dodge to avoid getting yeah. out, like nicked by it. So it kind of messed up with his like uh, combo. It reminds me of like Robin the gyro because he kind of like trapped him in the middle. I mean, you can't spell Robin without Rob. Yeah. Okay, that first stock got deleted immediately. Yeah. Okay, good setups from Mr. E. So up air, really strong option for Lucina. It combos yeah. into pretty much imagination. Yeah, any area you want, basically. You try to get the narrow one. Jules is going to hold on to shield. Because he was facing away, he didn't want to risk trying to do a turnaround. Yeah. And I can tell Eric is trying to play this deficit as like patient as he can, because like he doesn't want to take too much damage without taking the stock. I see him like closing his eyes in between hits, just to like mentally prepare himself. He's very animated when he plays. So yeah. you, you, you can get you can get into Mystery's mental state just by looking at his camera yeah. shot. 
Okay, you gotta go for that air dodge to avoid that dinky ass uh, dash stack. Parry into the grab. Right. Order off stage pressure. Jewel trying to trying to catch that double yeah. jump, but kind of a weird exchange. I feel like Jewel just kind of like blue screen for a second. And that down smash, the sour hit, not gonna kill. Oh, that was so smart! Jewel what? is one step ahead. Like th that was the first time that mystery actually let go of the ledge to go for the yeah. re grab, and then he went for the Thor, of all yeah. things. Yeah. I've never even the seen Thor him do that up. move this set. All right, and Jewel has only three more arc fires. Okay. A good follow up. Runs up, goes for the forward tilt. Jewel literally just one stock away from being right, guaranteed top smash. two. Uh, yeah. Good punish. Uh, Jewel drifted in there because he knew if he didn't drift. Footstool? Did, wait, did he save yeah. him with that dolphin slash? Uh, I think you would have no, made, no, no, yeah. made it back. You would have made it back. Robin's recovery got super buffed. In right, this I, game. I forget the second one, he goes super high. Yeah. All right, save pressure with the Nair and the Fair. Jewel just standing there. He knows he can't drop this lead, and if he moves, Mystery's so good at reacting to movement. Yeah. If there's anyone that can get a lot of momentum, it's yeah. Mystery. Yeah. So if he takes his stock, I think Mystery will take the set. Yeah. It, it all depends on the stock right here. All right. Nair? Oh, right. no, this could be the start. All right, and Mystery with momentum. All he needs is one good up tilt. One oh no, accidental air dodge. Puts him in a bad situation, but manages to return the yeah. tables. That was so unfortunate for Mr. E. That up only whiffed because he got a phantom footstool right before he went for the up -y. Yeah, and you know he didn't want that. Yeah. 34. All right, grab him, throw him off. All right, he's going for more grabs now. He, uh, Jewel knows that, like, you know, he, Mr. E won't get that much off of grabs. Yeah. But it's still, like, if he keeps going for it over and over, It'll eventually work. Try to counter the arc fire, not the answer. And Jewel had a kill there, but he opts to charge instead of confirming off of that arc fire. Back air? Jewel took it. Jewel's moving on to grand finals at Xeno 155. Yeah. What, in, what in the world? Yeah, what a timeline for Jewel, man. He's really been on the up and coming like these past few weeks. With an unorthodox character, yeah, no less. For sure. This is back air. Bam, he saw him going for the double jump. Had an answer waiting just for him, and he's yeah. looking—he's looking extremely pretty going into first place. Like he, whoever manages to get down into the losers' finals has to take two sets off this man. Yeah.